Did the U.S. really try to win a war with bats? Yep. And they almost pulled it off. During World War II, a dentist, yes, a dentist, came up with a crazy idea. What if we dropped thousands of bats from a plane, each carrying a tiny time bomb? Here's how it would go. The bats were packed in a bomb-shaped case and kept asleep with ice. When dropped, the case would open mid-air, the bats would wake up, fly off, and hide inside enemy buildings. Many Japanese buildings at the time were made of wood and paper. The bats with tiny napalm bombs on them would settle in and, boom, burn the buildings from the inside out. No need to bomb cities directly. They actually tested this. And during one test, some bats escaped and burned down a U.S. airbase hangar by accident. Whoops. The military saw potential. More fires per dollar than normal bombs. But it was slow, unpredictable. And then, boom, the atomic bomb was ready. Bat bombs were dropped from the plan forever. It never saw combat, but the bat bomb was real. And it proves war makes people try some really weird stuff. From dentist to bat bomber, truth is stranger than fiction.